No, no, not that button either. Let's leave. You know what I did that for? I keep thinking I'm pressing the run button. What is the run button anyway? Is there a run button? Is there a walk faster? It's the right trigger. I'm so mad. Let me, hold on, let me look. Let me look at this. Really? Nothing? There's no type of... I'm mad. I can't even figure out how... You know what, let's just leave. Let's just leave before something else gets fucked up. Oh my god. That did not just happen. Hmm. Hmm. Here's Taylor. Hi, Taylor. Hi, Taylor. Just because you were nice to Victoria doesn't mean I have to be nice to you. Let's not I don't want to fight with you or Victoria. Instead of smack talk, let's just talk for once. You're funny. Well, I'm not doing anything at the moment. So talk. God. Uh, you know what? Kate's Kate video. Kate is really upset about the video. All this gossip is cruel. Boo-hoo. That's what happens when you preach to everybody about sex. She'll live. Why do you hang Victoria? out with Victoria? She's pretty mean to you and Courtney. And she's bossy too. Look, you don't know her. I do. And she's one of the best friends you could have. I guess I've had mean, bossy best friends, too. Better than having mean, bossy parents. I would love it if my mom was mean or bossy instead of sick. But whatever. We've had our talk. Hmm. Fair enough. Do I? No. I've gotten all the information I need from her. Hmm. Okay, so that's what my plan was. My plan was to... What was I doing again? Matter of fact, I might as well talk to Samuel. See how he's, he's doing. Hey, Samuel. You're up early. Oh, hello, young Max. I do love the early morning. Everything is so calm and quiet. And I can feel the animals waking up with me. Hmm. That's one thing I truly love about Arcadia Bay. It's all those cool animals in the forest. The squirrels always come in the morning for food. I can hear them whisper. What animals do you see in the forest? <laughs> Don't laugh, but I saw a doe that seemed to be looking right at me, like it was trying to communicate. Oh, that's your spirit animal. Nothing weird there except you saw yours. Could be a sign about your destiny. <laughs> hmm. What do I know? My spirit animal is a squirrel. Hmm. So, what did you think about that freak snow shower yesterday? Another message from the Earth to get our shit together. I will say that Samuel hasn't seen anything like that before. Hmm. Fair enough. I so don't want to get in the way of your morning ritual. See you later. Of course you will. Okay, so I'm gonna go this way. I want to try and find Warren. What? What happened? Hmm. This is Nathan's father. This is a message to let you know that attempts to slander and blackmail my son will be met with many lawyers and legal ramifications. You're not the first student at Blackwater to try this. I hope you're the last. Consider this a final polite warning. So the son and the daddy. Max, check it out. Oh, horse feathers. Oh, it's Warren. Fine. I was just what talking you about you. Oh, well, nothing. Waiting for a call? I mean, I already took the call. Anyway, I wanted to rap about that action yesterday. 
Thank you. By the way, thank you for stepping in. You were pretty badass, Warren. I owe you. Oh, yes, you do. I got knocked on my ass by that dick. I'm some personal superhero. You're a real everyday hero. You stood up to a bully, and it was awesome. Even though you left me with said bully and ran off with that girl, she's pretty punk rock. How do you know her? An old friend, Chloe Price. We haven't seen each other in a while. I bet you were glad to see her blast up in that truck like a rock star. Which begs the question, why is Nathan Prescott getting psycho on you? I busted him in the bathroom yesterday with a gun. I'll give you the story later. Principal Wells is taking care of it now, I hope. Weird fucking week. Like that bizarro snowfall yesterday? Speaking hmm. of dystopia, that drive-in is having a 70s Planet of the Apes marathon. Let's go ape! Yes, that's exactly what I need. I love those old school ape films. Well, that was easier than I thought. Cool, I'll text you the info. Gosh dang it, it just dawned on me. <laughs> I said yes to Juliet about going to that party. I would much rather hang out with Warren, honestly. Gosh. Like. <sighs> David talking to Nathan cannot be a good thing. This has something to do with Kate. Or Rachel. Wait a minute. In the beginning, didn't Chloe during their first during their argument in the beginning, weren't they saying something about drugs? Or like he knows how to get stuff or something like that? What if their family is like a whole is like a ma not I think I think mafia would be the right word. Like that's how they're so rich, you think? Ooh, that'd be that'd be interesting. Where am I going anyway? I forget. <laughs> She's gonna see something weird. Never mind. Oh, hey, that one dude's in the front of the bus. The guy with the, the, the sketchbook. Dang. I'm just sitting here trying to think of what could actually be happening. What has Nathan done? Hmm. Huh. And why is... Hmm. What is the big deal with Kate? Like, I get the video. I get the video is a problem. But something happened to... <gasps> oh, shoot. You know what? Maybe... Maybe Nathan... At, maybe Nathan was at that... Yeah, he was at the party. And then... I'm just trying to wonder, why did Kate show up there anyway? I mean, I'm mad because I think she told me and I forgot what the reason was. Hmm. Don't try to take it from me. Huh? It's mine. What? What happened? I wouldn't dream of it. I'm going to be a millionaire. Hope nobody steals my lottery. Talk about going oh, back in time. The diner looks exactly the same. Oh, this is where Chloe told me to meet her. Never mind. I was confused. Hmm. I saw somebody walking up. Hello. Man, that smell of breakfast and the sound of clanging silverware mm, makes me feel 13 again. Chloe, you here? Grab a booth at the diner. Mom will feed you. Somebody better. I'll be lucky. Okay. Oh, so her mom. That's her mom, isn't it? Isn't it? 
Okay. Cool. All right, let me just sit. Sit. Let me just sit down, I guess. And there she is. A lovely young woman. How are you doing, Max? Hi, Joyce. Mm. It's nice to see you again. You look the same. <laughs> like I'm still a waitress at Two Whales after all these years. No, like you still look pretty. Nice save, kid. You're still <laughs> smart. But I wish you'd been here to help save Chloe. She got busted yesterday smoking out. Again. Oh. I know. Chloe told me that her stepfather hit her. I am sorry that was your introduction to David. I hope you get to know him on your terms, not Chloe's. He's a good man, he just... Yeah, I'm sure he is since you married him, but... Don't be so harsh on Chloe. It's good you're here. I was hoping you could be a good influence in her life now. I will be. Of course. Promise. I know things were hard for you and Chloe. I feel bad I didn't call. Now my folks are in Seattle and I'm all alone at Blackwell. It's my karma. You did the right thing. You moved forward with your life. I did after William passed on. Chloe? Chloe chose to stay angry. Anyway, I hope we see more of you. Chloe needs an old friend again. Joyce, I am so sorry about William. I have great memories of him. I'm glad, Max. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Even if Chloe doesn't understand yet. Oh, uh, I'm sure she Chloe does. Chloe understands. She just needs time. I know that sucks for you. Oh, she hit all the phases. Expulsion, running away, drugs, bad boys, tattoos, piercings, blue hair. <laughs> now she's got to rebel against her stepfather. I see <laughs> why. I mean, why? What did Chloe tell you? How is, hold on, how is she looking? Ma'am, how are you not looking at me? Well, Chloe texted me that David slapped her yesterday. He feels awful, and he will be punished. But Chloe does push David, and it's not fair. He paid his dues in a war. He does care about her, along with all the students at Blackwell. Mm. I want to ask him about... I get it. I get it, Joyce. Her. I know Chloe still likes to stir things up. Yeah, she does provoke people, especially David. I just want us to be a family soon. I guess I it's just want... all about time. I think you're right, Joyce. <sighs> so, now let's get down to the nitty gritty. What do you want to eat? Dang it, I wanted to ask her. Only the waffle. last good Belgian waffle I had was here when I was 13 years old. So, bring it on. Now finish your coffee. Dang it, I wanted to ask her about Kate. But like, what would she know? You know? Hmm. One Belgian waffle for the hungry girl, pronto. One Belgian <laughs> waffle at 12 o'clock. Nerd high. graffiti. I love the delicious anticipation of breakfast. Hmm. <laughs> Nerd graffiti. What was this? Warren must have been here. Beer and bacon before I die. This is a diner, not a bar. No beer? <laughs> Looks like you had plenty. Stick with the bacon. Period. Oh, sweet. I forgot she said drink this. I thought she already did it. <laughs> this is like fourth dimensional deja vu. I keep going back in time. No beer? What, what kind of dive is this? Who keeps saying that? Sir. Incoming. Sick of this man. I can hear your stomach rumbling from here, Max. Here, you'll love this. I'm drooling like a baby. Still can't believe you're a woman. When I look at pictures of Chloe, ugh. Mm. 
speak of the devil. Mom and Max, together again. And Chloe looking for a free meal. You put your whole damn college fund on your tab. I'm treating Chloe for breakfast. No, you're not. This is my treat. To you, for coming back to rescue my daughter. Nobody needs to rescue me. Unless you set your room on fire smoking out. Oh god, here it comes. Didn't you and Sergeant Pepper already read me the riot act last night? Call him David if you don't want to be lectured. You only get one damn slice of bacon a day. Hmm. You guys are still the same. Another reason to blow this town? What is this shit on the jukebox? Nothing, I can't hear it. Oh yeah, that's why. <laughs> now that that's out of the way. Well, whatever it is. Let's hmm. talk about your superpower. I don't have any explanation. And I can't explain why I saw that crazy fucking tornado. Come on, that's just a daydream. I want proof you can rewind time. This is all How can I prove it if you can't so remember? Fast. We'll start slow. Right here, now. Mm, I can tell you every single thing you have in your pockets. You have x-ray vision, dude? I don't even know what's in my pockets. Let me see. X-ray vision. Okay, Max. Impress me. What? Wait, I didn't even see that. Hold on, wait. Did she? What? What? Tube of glitter. You I have don't a even... tube of glitter in there, right? Nada. Eh, wrong answer. Okay, psychic girl. Let me show you what's actually in my pockets. Keys, isn't it? That was beyond epic fail. You even made me want to believe you. So what the heck? What is that? You need to look at the items and rewind so Chloe believes you. So none okay, of Max, those answers were right? Study every item carefully and don't forget anything. Oh no. If I would have said keys the first time, I would have been right. Wow. Wow. I'm mad. Turn it back. Turn it back. Turn it. I forget how to make this go faster. Okay, there we go. Bro, well, this is me telling you what's inside your pockets. Okay, Max. I'm hella ready. Keys. Your car keys. Duh, way too easy. I need details. Describe my keychain. Panda. A cute robot panda keychain. Not bad, Super Max. You do have that Irish luck, Caulfield. What else? Uh, cigarettes. I'm pretty sure you have cigarettes on you. Yes, you know I'm a smoker. <clears throat> but how many cigarettes? How many? What the f <clears throat> I hate this woman. Six. Six cigarettes. Absolutely. Wrong. Okay, uh, psychic girl. Let me show you what's- What in the- I'm not in the mood. I'm not in the mood for this woman. Okay, Having Max. Me rewind study every item lines. carefully and don't forget anything. It was set. <sighs> okay. Panda keychain. Got it. Seven cigs. Got it. One cent. Five cent. Quarter dollar. Yeah. And then that parking ticket. Out of parking. One five quarter. Okay, one five quarter seven. No. Panda seven. One five quarter parking ticket. Having me rewind 20 different times. Ugh. This is me telling you. Okay, Max. I'm hella ready. Money. Hmm. Some money. Clearly I'm rich as fuck. How much do I have? Hey, so that's one, five, quarter. What is a quarter dollar? What? Quarter dollar? 
Is that 75? I don't fucking know. Wait. What? Is that 82? 82 cents. I wish. Okay, psychic girl. Oh my motherfucking god. Oh my motherfucking god. I hate this woman. I'm having to rewind so many different times just to get this right. <laughs> Okay, Max. There. Money. Hmm. There. Clearly I'm rich as f There. 86. 86 cents. That's right, living large in Arcadia Bay. So that was cool. Show me more. How can the parking, parking ticket? ticket? You know me well. But what is the exact time I was busted? Are you fucking <laughs> Fucking 11, 11. 10 a.m.? That is so wrong. Okay, oh psychic girl. Goodness. Let me show you what's actually. Right, okay, Max. Study every so item carefully and don't forget anything. Why am I? Motherfucker, I took my headphones out. Out of pissiness. Why am I friends with this hoe? Hang on. So that's 1034. Okay. 1034, 86, you got this, 76. Max. Now rewind and blow Chloe's mind. This is me telling you what's inside your pockets. Okay, Max. I'm hella ready. <sighs> A parking ticket. You know me well. But. 10.34 a.m. Booyah! Max can tell time! Even a broken clock is right twice a day. Whatever the hell that means. Hmm. Clearly I'm rich as- I'm gonna have to get all these right, aren't I? Cents. That's right, living large in Arcadia Bay. So that was cool. Show me more. I'm pretty sure you have cigarettes on you. Yes, you know I'm a smoker. But how many cigarettes? Seven cigarettes. A superpower that allows you to count cigarettes. Cool. Amazing. Terrible. Something else in my pockets? Your keys. Your car keys. Duh, way too easy. I need details. Describe my keychain. It's a panda. A cute robot panda keychain. Not bad, Super Max. Jesus, ever loving. Just, ugh. Why does she look shocked? She chills. knew that. I literally just got chills all over my neck. Why you do you get powers. spooked? You know that. You knew exactly what I'll the answer was. Take that crap off the table, Chloe. Sure, Mom. How's the food, Max? Better than I remembered. Very good save. Man, I'm hungry like the wolf. Clearly. I am freaking out about what just happened. You, you have to show me more. Something way cooler so I will believe you without any doubt. I will predict the future. No way. Girl. Now, pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. Your mom comes over and waves. Oops. Did Oops. you break another cup? Really? No refill for you. A man drops down. Now that. I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started they it. They start fighting. I'm finishing it. She walks in. Goes back there. That's the best song I've ever This is yet. sure the hell the? better than that other garbage. I think our jukebox is headed for Davy Jones's locker. So, what are you waiting for? What? Now I should rewind and tell Chloe everything that just happened. Okay. She walked over and said hi. He dropped the cup. No refill. That guy got a call. And the police siren started. And then those two started fighting. And then that lady walked in. 
and then the jukebox went haywire. Okay. Let me talk to I'm you. I'm going to predict four events that will happen in the next 30 seconds or so. Yeah. The trucker drops his mug and Joyce rips him a new one. So what happens next? Um, yeah. The cop gets an emergency alert on his radio and his partner in the car leaves without him. Well, let's just see how this goes down. Mm -hmm. Excuse me. <sighs> Justin and Trevor are fighting and Joyce breaks it up. This is getting good. Can't wait to see what happens. Ugh. What? Cockroach? I didn't know what... Uh, I don't know. A butterfly. The jukebox goes crazy as a butterfly lands on it. Pretty bizarro, Max. Oh, god dang it. It's but not a butterfly. Let's see if everything happens that. like you said. I would have noticed that. Now that one thing is gonna... Now I'm about to rewind all over again. Oops. Dude, Did you, you right. break another cup? Really? No refill for you. Shh. And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a mm. dick. Oh, so Slap cool. Me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. That is wild. This is a sad day in Maxville. This is surely. And I was gonna say cockroach to begin with. I hate this game sometimes. I'm going to predict over and over. Can mug the trucker. So what happened? Partner leaves. Well, yeah, she stops him. Getting. And then, cockroach. The jukebox goes crazy as a cockroach crawls on it. Pretty bizarro, Max. But let Oops. Did you break another cup? Oh, wait. Really? Go, Mom. No refill for you. Shh. Well, now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You called it. But he's off to go bust some skaters. You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. Trevor and Justin must be in love. You predicted a cockroach on the jukebox? Ew. I pledge allegiance to Max and the power for which she stands. <laughs> this isn't a toy. Chloe. Don't pledge allegiance. I do have to be careful how I use it. Screw that. Of course it's a toy. The best toy ever? You can bang anyone with no strings attached, rewind time, and boom! It's like it never happened! Grow up. I can't stand her. Maybe you made a move on me and I would never know. Yes, Girl. that's what I did. You can rewind time, Max. That's fucking insane. We have to play. No, I don't I'm not time. playing with you. You did not just say that. Huh. Check out your nose. Too much blow? Is she hey, bleeding? you okay? Too much excitement. See what happens when we hook up again? Then, let's go to one of my secret lairs and fully test your power. You need a sidekick to guide you. Okay, If the girl, game forces me, me the way to, Chloe's cave. to play this game with her, I'm gonna be mad. <laughs>